uh, there's a way to do development right and there's a way to do it wrong. A couple but hundred people protested on Wilson Street in Ancaster's historic core in front of the Mar House. They're worried new construction will change the landscape and look of the village. I love the feel of the town and the building. I've always loved the feel of, of old things and I think there's a true beauty and art to them. The stone house was built back in 1840 and while the owners and businesses have changed a few times in the past 180 years, the outside hasn't aged much. I think they're absolutely they're gorgeous eh? and the things that we should we should preserve, you know, for future generations to for them to remember. The land is now owned by a developer, which means this property could be turned into condos. Wilson Street is a cultural heritage landscape, uh, which means that it should be protected. If and when this land gets redeveloped, it's not like the building is just going to be demolished. It'll actually be moved back around 300 feet, but some are worried that could damage the integrity of the building. Well, there'll be a new foundation prepared at the expense of the developer. They will move it over their expense and they will restore it to its original glory. The building actually sits on contaminated land because of a former gas station that was next door. So Councillor Ferguson says first the land needs to be cleaned up before any new construction takes place. But even with new development, this old beauty will stay. Their intent is to use it as a clubhouse for the condominium corporation. There are 18 conditions or requirements, you could call them, that the developer has to meet to get approval for this move. Nothing can happen on site until the conditions are met. They include a consultation with a structural engineer and to submit a new survey to the city. What we would like to see is that any development that comes in here that it be consistent with the context uh, that already exists here. Be patient and we'll look after it. We'll make sure it's done right. And if this land is redeveloped into condos or townhomes, it's still a number of years away before construction even starts. Sean Cowan, CHCH News, Ancaster.